morning everyone and welcome back to my channel so this weekend me and Billy have got some really exciting things so I thought I would do a weekend vlog for you so I've currently now just started my breakfast so I've got a New York red onion and chive bagel and they are so good and then I've got some avocado and some smoked salmon to go on here which is very extra for me for a Saturday but you come say hello to Billy darling Hello. He's currently eating, what have you got? Maple and pecan cereal. How is it? It's from our Lidl, wasn't it? It's pretty good. Pretty yummy. So we're just gonna have our breakfast. I will do an outfit of the day in a minute and I'll catch for you after breakfast because we're going to the range. Billy's got like a flight simulator thing today. Uh, we're also gonna go to the gym. I can't remember what else. I think we're gonna make a cake. We've got quite a lot of things planned, so I thought it'd be really cool to vlog it for you. So, yeah, let's just get on with the day. So, we are now about to head off. So, I thought I'd make myself a coffee for the go. So, I thought I'd show you because I haven't tried this one yet. But I use, like, Outpro. Um, I usually use the coconut milk. But I'm trying chocolate this time. I'm making us a coffee to go. And basically, I put it in my little machine here for the espresso, which is now about to go. So we'll press the little button there. And then I just cook like the chocolate milk over a low heat until it bubbles and then make a chocolate latte. We'll see how it goes. I normally use coconut and it's really nice because it literally tastes like the pasta one. So hopefully it's gonna be good as well. Mainly for you, dear. I'm not yeah, mainly for me. He'll still try it though. Don't you? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Then we're gonna head to the range, and then. Can't be too long. I know. And then we're going Milden Hall for Billy's flight simulator thing. So we'll catch you in a bit. Well, we've just been in to the range. There was an alright amount of stuff in there, but we just didn't really need a lot of stuff, did we? Yeah, it's a bit of a tap shop in it. Yeah, it's, it's a proper hit and miss, but. For the kitchen, I got a little doorstop, little elephant, and I think this was $5.99, so I got that, and because I'm a massive kid, they had the massive like millions thing, so I got myself some millions for $1.99, and that's literally all that we got. We're now heading to the flight simulator thing, and we're gonna stop off at one of the new McDonald's because Billy wants to get a double cheeseburger, and I really fancy a Fanta, so we're gonna pop in there. Um, I did make this coffee earlier, but I don't really like it. I tried something and it did not work. It literally just tastes like chocolate milk. It doesn't taste like coffee at all. Um, and that's pretty much, I feel like I'm doing like a massive wave of the camera at the moment. Wave? Yeah, like this. Oh. Um, but that's pretty much it for the moment. Uh, I don't know if you want to explain about your flight simulator thing. Basically, by the looks of it, Once we get to Mildred Hall, I reckon. Yeah. Yeah. 
we have about an hour before Billy actually needs to go to his flight simulator thing. So we've found a retail park in Thetford, so we're going to have a quick look in B&M as well, aren't we? We are. So if I say anything exciting, then I'll show you, but if not, no, just... You won't see anything. <laughs> you won't, pretty much. Which is what was stating the obvious there, really. Um, it's a bit cold out, so I'm going to put my jacket back on. But we're basically, for the bathroom, we don't have a set of drawers yet, do we? So we no. went when we went into the range, we were looking there, but they didn't actually have well, any... they were nice, but they're, they're 45 quid. And they're like this deep of drawers, so it's not actually what we want. Because we want it to fit like our shampoos and stuff and make it a little bit neater in there. So we're hoping B&M might be our friend instead. Mm. So we're going to go in there and we'll catch you in a little bit. Catch you in a bit. So it's been a few hours. We are now back home. So what have we done since we last recorded? So I went into B&M, we got two things, so I got myself some more coffee because it was a pound instead of like three pound which is really really cheap and I also got the pink stuff which is basically a little pot of like clay stuff and you like can like really scrub into stuff to get it for like things really really clean and I really wanted it for the bathroom because there's a couple of bits that where the water is like not dried properly and it's just gone a bit mouldy and I feel like that will like properly clean that up um we then went to billy's flight simulator thing which i will probably add the clips in just before this or just after but he really really enjoyed himself and that was just a nice little present that i thought you know something different isn't it he loves planes he loves playing like his flight like he's got like flight simulators that stuff jazz so he really enjoyed having the full shebang of it all we then just went to the fish shop and Billy just got a few more fish, so he's now sorting all them out downstairs. So I thought I'd quickly just show you the outfit of the day before, oh, the lighting is not on point there. So I thought I'd just quickly show you my outfit of the day before I now get changed into some nice joggers and feel more relaxed. I've got a little bit bleh, and I don't know why really, um, but I'll quickly show you the outfit of the day. So it's a little bit different for me. I feel like I'm getting into the summer vibes now. So. I've just got on my mum jeans, which I absolutely love. They are getting more and more ripped, which is the only problem. And they were from Misguided. And then I've just you just got like a black vest top on, which is from Primark. If you have not got any of these yet, they're like three pound, I think. And they are so comfy, they're so thick. Like you don't even really need to wear a bra with them if you don't want to. And I then just had my red puffer on from Primark as well. And then I think I just had my van, yeah, I had my vans on today. So I'm now gonna go get into some joggers just to feel a bit more cozy. And I'm not sure what we're gonna do for dinner yet. We were gonna make a pad thai, but I'm not really fancying it. So I think we're just gonna go to the supermarket and see what we can get. And maybe go to the gym tonight. If not, we're def I'm definitely going tomorrow. Um, get into the swing of things. And that's pretty much the update, so. I'll just catch you up in a little bit. Good evening, everyone. So it's now been a few hours. So we didn't end up going to the gym. We are, de well, I'm definitely going tomorrow because Billy's going to S off in the morning. So I'm gonna get up early with him on a Sunday, I know. But I'm gonna go to the gym, it's gonna be completely empty. So it means I can get a really good workout in. And I think I'm gonna record a little bit for this vlog. And then I might actually do a separate video for next week potentially I'm not too sure yet so I think I'm gonna be doing that we've had dinner and we just couldn't really be bothered to cook so we shared a pizza and just got some like chicken pieces so we had that for dinner we've got pasta bake for tomorrow which we picked up and Billy's now on his computer and I've decided to watch Gossip Girl again I've been watching it for a little bit to be honest if you look I'll just show it up so currently on season three, episode 15, and I just love it. I don't know about anyone else, but I watched like this, 
90210 and Pretty Little Thing, not Pretty Little Thing, that's a shop, Pretty Little Liars all at the same time. So I don't know why, but I just really fancied re-watching Gossip Girl and I've been loving it. And because I've watched it already, there's so many things I actually forgot about, but at the same time, it's just nice like to re-watch something. I don't know if anyone else likes doing that. I do it all the time. Like my OG film is the a Cinderella story and I've probably watched it at least like 10 times this year. Not even exaggerating. So I'm not gonna chill out for us tonight. I'm not gonna go take my makeup off. I'm gonna put my hair in some French plaits. So I then haven't got to do anything with it tonight slash tomorrow. And then I can have a shower tomorrow after the gym, uh, make myself look nice. Um, Oh, Billy also, we've ordered from Pretty Little Thing and he's ordered some outfits for me for a video to do tomorrow, which I'm very nervous about. I have no idea what he's bought. So he's done that. So that's gonna be exciting to turn up tomorrow. I've also got a very belated Christmas present turning up tomorrow. So, because I'm vlogging, I can show you it. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Um, I'm gonna hold it off. I'm not gonna tell you now. I'm gonna have to wait till the rest of the video. So Yeah, that's pretty much it. So I just thought I'd catch you up of where we're up to and I will see you all in the morning Good morning, everyone. It's now the next day. It's now Sunday. It's currently Quarter past eight. I've been up since just after seven. I've had some like crunchy nuts cereal didn't have a huge amount just dropped Billy off to go airsofting and I'm now gonna hit the gym. I think I might add a little bit into this vlog, um, but I'm now actually gonna film me doing a workout for a video because Billy ordered all my stuff last night, but he forgot to hit next day. Well, he said he hit it, but it's changed itself back. So the delivery is actually not coming till next week which is really annoying so it means I've got to do an improv for another video so I thought I would just do my shreddy one which I was going to do anyway so instead I'm going to go do that I think I'm going to just do a full body workout and do a bit of everything and then go from there I'm dreading it already I can feel my legs aching and I hadn't even gone in there yet but I thought I'd actually try out some new stuff so I've got some things from BND it used to be Grace Fit UK so I've got my sliders to try out which is one exciting thing um, I've also got my resistant bands which I'm excited to use and I've also got like my ankle straps as well but they're OG because they say Grace Fit UK on it instead of BM for ND so I'm not going to go hit into the gym I'm gonna start with a warm up and go from there basically and I'll catch you either while I'm in there or later on today. I've debate I'm really fancy doing some baking today, so I think I think I'm gonna get some stuff to do some baking. It's so weird how you so used to get to a camera and then I'm now on my phone. Basically my memory blocked up while I was in the gym. So I've done my exercising at the gym. I feel really, really good. I feel like an absolute tomato. I'm ready to go home, have a shower and then start editing for the rest of the day until Billy finishes airsoft. And then I think we're gonna go see his family and make a cake. And I need to say happy birthday to my dad. So pretty, really busy day, really. I'm hoping to like have everything done by like four or five o'clock so then at least then I can have like the evening to chill out. Right, I'm now back home. I've now sorted out the memory on the laptop so now it's now going to sort itself out. It's going to be about sort of 15, 20 minutes to do. So I'm now going to get my butt in the shower, sort this out. I ordered something from ASOS yesterday and it's a new pair of trainers and I'm so excited and they're meant to be turning up today. And I have options to either leave them in a safe place or leave them with a neighbour and they haven't, they just told me they're gonna come back tomorrow, which is really annoying because I'm at work tomorrow. So I've called them up and moaned. So hopefully they said they're gonna try and re-deliver it out today. So I'm just waiting for a call back on that. And that's just like completely thrown me off. I just really want my new pair of shoes and I really wanna show you them as well. So just annoying. So I'm just gonna go get have a shower, fresh myself up, feel a little bit nicer. Then I'm just basically gonna start editing and Hopefully I'll get a call and they'll turn up today. Just had a shower. I've just 
like moisturized and things like that so i'm now going to just dry my hair get myself ready for the day it's currently 20 to 11 i would have probably been done sooner but fuming basically i did previously mention in the last clip so i ordered a pair of trainers from asos and i have next day delivery so i got that and it always comes through dpd so with dpd i have like settings so if i'm not in they'll either leave it in a safe place or they'll leave it with a neighbor but apparently they didn't get it so he's just apparently delivering it back tomorrow so i called up and said like look this isn't good enough because i put requests through and they literally were just giving me excuses and i don't know if anyone else is the same but when you're annoyed at something you don't want excuses like you just want it sorted so they're like oh yeah don't worry like we can give it back tomorrow and I was like, well, what if it does the same thing? Like, what if he leaves it and well, doesn't leave it? Then it's just annoying. But they're like, oh, we've put strict instructions on, so they won't. But I said, like, like surely they can come back today. They, they, they're they based in Snetterton, which is about half an hour away. And surely you would think that it's not that far away from me. Like, once he's finished his round, he could just simply come back and drop it off. Because at the end of the day, it's not my fault. It's their fault. But I just feel like I've just needed to rant about it because I'm human but there's not really much I can do about it so I'm a bit annoyed because I really want to wear them today and I also want um, I'm like to wear to work tomorrow because I'm really excited I'm like so excited for my shoes really excited I'm not really annoyed that they're not here <sighs> so annoying but less blabbering less moaning just gonna get myself ready for the day basically a few hours on now I think the last time I picked up the camera was me getting sorted and to go pick Billy up. Billy's a bit grumpy. He's a bit sore and tired, aren't you? A little bit. A little bit. I should burp, sorry. Oh, that's all right. Um, we're now, yeah, but back to be fair, we both are, aren't we? Yeah. I've just finishing editing tonight's video, so that's now currently rendering and uploading, which is good. So we're now heading into Morrison's to pick up some bits for my dad for his birthday cake and also some bits for next week. We are just gonna grab some lunch and bits and bobs just for like tomorrow and the rest of the week. And then on Tuesday, we'll go pick up some like dinners and things um, for the rest of the week because hopefully next weekend we are going to Portsmouth. We were meant to go a couple of weeks ago but one of our friends was ill and we didn't want to catch it so we're hoping to go next weekend instead so yeah we're basically gonna go get some lunch go grab some bits to make a cake and then i'll probably catch you up when we start making the cake because i'm very excited Bit. We are now back home and I have dressed into some pyjamas to be all snug and cosy. We currently have, oh good timing, the cakes in the oven and I've sort of just had a bit of a skit, split, no? I can't remember the word. A blitz around the kitchen. So I've just got a little bit of left of washing up to do over here. Um, Billy's done the cake, so I just need to like clean that little bit, but the rest of it is now all pretty much clean. So that's now all done and dusted. So just waiting for the cake to finish cooking. Then we're gonna have our pasta bake and we've also got some cheesy garlic bread. And then we're gonna sit down and watch Harry Potter. We're currently watching all of them at the moment, aren't we? So we're up to all of the Phoenix, so the fifth one. So there's five. So there's technically so five, six, so we've got four films left to watch. But after all the things, there's three left. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Watch. That's what I just said. You said five. You said four. You said we've got five films left to watch. No, I said we've got four. You said five. Do you want me to replay it back like I did with the other video? Yeah. And if you watched the sweets one, when you said blueberry, and I was like, oh, I have a blueberry one, you went, no, blue raspberry. I've got it on camera, darling, that I was right and you were wrong. You just said five. No, I said it's the fifth film and we've got four, four left to watch because Deathly Hallows is split into two. Oh. He always thinks he's right, but he's not always right. So this is our cupcake 
we're making for my dad's birthday tomorrow. So it's just cooling at the moment and then after dinner I think we're going to start icing it and stuff. And my dad loves Bailey's and Terry's chocolate orange so we've got all of that to decorate on top which is pretty cool. And our dinner is done and this is the pasta. Very very excited. We are currently just waiting for the garlic bread to brown a little bit more and once that's done we're going to carry on watching Harry Potter and I'll show you the cake once it's done. Evening everyone. It's actually now a couple of days later on and pretty much editing Amy. I'm now in the middle of editing the vlog and realised that I didn't do an outro and I said there was a couple of things that I was going to discuss with you and I haven't because it's been an absolute palaver. So I previously mentioned you about a new pair of trainers that were turning up so I thought I'll quickly just show you them. Honestly they are amazing like so nice. I don't know if you can pick it up it's like a really nice like pale purple and then like a pearly sort of colour over here and then it's gone on the back as well, as well and these were a really special treat which I absolutely love I'm actually obsessed um, the other thing was my dad's birthday cake I forgot to record it so because my dad's now got it I'll insert a couple of pictures like over me speaking now so you can see what it looks like and the last thing that turned up which I'm so happy it's already done is the pretty little thing order so I've got Billy to go in there and check everything's there and he said yes yeah, they're absolutely fine so we're gonna film that either tonight or tomorrow more than likely tomorrow to go up for Sunday's video and then hopefully over the weekend I will be filled doing another vlog of us going down to Portsmouth so it's all been a bit guns blazing I've kind of just moved offices as well um, which is another manic situation but that's definitely a story for another time otherwise I'll be on here for another like 10,000 hours basically so that's pretty much it for my vlog I haven't actually like combined it all together so I really really hope that you enjoyed it uh, if you did enjoy it then don't forget to give me a big thumbs up if you are new to my channel then I'd love for you all to stick around and hit the subscribe button down below I upload videos every Thursday and Sunday and I'd love for you all to stick around and join the little fan that we've got going on we're now so close to 300 subscribers so I'd love to get that by the end of the month that would be absolutely amazing and yeah I'll just see you all in Sunday's video see you later